Okay, hi. So here's the situation. Let me get comfy here for a second. I am going to Vegas in just a matter of days here now for my birthday. I am going to be turning 27 on 27, and so what better to ring in a sort of pseudo golden birthday than in Vegas? <laughs> as excited as I am, I still have to pack. And um, I don't know if you're anything like me, but packing for a trip, especially like a birthday trip where you're trying to serve looks, um, can be stressful. So that's what we're doing today. I am filming my struggle with packing. There's not much more to explain. I think I need to stop stalling and <sighs> let's pack. Let's go to Vegas. Let's go to Vegas. Frame it that way. I have no idea if you can even see me. If not, hi, hopefully you can hear me. Don't know if you can hear me either. Anyway, um, we are in my closet that I cleaned specifically for this video. Yes, thank you, me. I need to get my suitcase down, first and foremost, which you can see I have stored right up here. Um, you know what, in the spirit of transparency, I just did this and realized my phone wasn't recording. <sighs> to act like I didn't just do this. So we're doing it again. That's why I'm sort of out of breath, but enjoy me taking my suitcase down. Oh. I actually already have most of my clothes picked out here that I've been planning on taking to Vegas. Some of these I specifically bought for Vegas. Uh, so I'm gonna pull those out and then rifle through my other ones <laughs> to see if I can find any others. Great. So this is what we're working with. This pile is what I had previously picked out and or bought specifically for this trip. And then these are just extra other options that we'll see if we can put something together with. The easiest way I can think of for me to do this and show off the outfits and everything for you and honestly easier for me to like help me with deciding what to take is going to be for me to try everything on. So that's what we're gonna do. Let's try on all of my Vegas birthday clothing options. Hmm. Okay, so this is the first outfit and I cannot decide if I like it better this way or like this. I've worn this outfit before like this and I really like it so I'm leaning towards styling it this way, but you know, I don't know. Either way, the same pieces are coming with. So this is one outfit, yes. This is the next outfit. What do we think? I don't know. I think it would look better without the bra straps. So, but my boobs are so small that like that looks odd. I don't know, I like it. I've never been able to wear these pants before. These are from IMG, and they've always been a bit long, but with my platform shoes, they kind of work and it's kind of cool. I kind of like it, very matrixy. Which bag do you like better? Okay, so we have this one, tried and true, black, simple, silver hardware, classic, great, or, the do this one. It's a oh, fanny pack. What are these called? Yeah. Fanny pack. Dung no. Bum bag. <laughs> Dungarees. Hmm. I don't know. It's also February, so I will likely need a coat with all of these. I love this coat. I thrifted this. It's a nice Calvin Klein coat. It was five dollars, I think, the thrift store. It's like super oversized and baggy. I also have this coat. 
think I like this one better. It's not nearly as boxy. It could be fun. It could be fun. I mean, when in Vegas, right? I should also mention that this trip is with family, so uh, my brother and my mom and her husband are coming with on this trip, so it's a little bit of a different vibe than if I was just going with like a bunch of friends or something. Still gonna be fun. I love hanging out with my family, especially these family members. We always have a great time together. Um, just a little bit of a different vibe. Okay, this is the outfit that I am most excited for. I'm obsessed with this. Oh my, are you kidding? This is so hot, I love this. So this entire outfit, sans the shoes, is from TJ Maxx. My dilemma is I can't figure out if I would wanna wear it open like this with bra exposed. I would normally, but like I'm gonna be with family. I don't know if I mentioned that yet or not. So the alternative is to either button it with the same bra or I got these little double-sided tape thingies, fashion tape. So I could also just wear it like this with tits out, no bra. Um, <laughs> that's an option too. I think that's fine. I don't think I like it as much as having the blazer open though, for some reason. We'll see, but regardless, this is an outfit, yes. I also will not be bringing any heels on this trip. As much as I would love to wear heels with some of these outfits, it's just a no-go. I mean, walking around Vegas is tiresome enough in just sneakers or regular shoes, and I'm not about to try it in heels. I also sprained my foot on New Year's Eve, and <laughs> it's not fully healed yet, so... We're just not gonna aggravate it. I am only bringing tennis shoes. This is alternate outfit option one. I don't know. I First of all, I don't know that it's gonna be warm enough for a shorts and like t-shirt type set, but it might. So it might be good to pack it just in case there is like one strangely hot day while I'm there. Also, I don't think these shoes go. I think they're too heavy. Like too much black. Honestly, I feel like these go much better. Let's see what it looks like with a coat. It's kind of fun, right? Like I kind of like it. I'd do maybe this purse. Hmm. You know, we'll see how much luggage space I have to work with, but this isn't a bad option. Probably not necessary. Probably won't get worn, but I don't know about this one, y'all. <laughs> okay, so this is another alternate option. This is actually the men's shirt, men's dress shirt. I can never get that right. This is the men's dress shirt I got in my most recent thrifting video. It's not bad, it's just, it's not good. I don't think I would actually wear this, so I'm not gonna pack it, but let me know if you like this outfit, cause maybe I can wear it some other time. I just, it, ew, I don't like it. <laughs> no. Okay, no. So this is one of those outfits that doesn't look horrible in the comfort of your own home, like when you're not out and about. But if you are seen in direct sunlight in this jumpsuit, oh my god. <laughs> it shows every little minuscule lump and bump and it's just, oof, I've seen pictures of myself in this outfit and didn't recognize who it was. It's that bad. Also, it's like very short. Who ordered a flood? Not me. Uh, this is a no. All right. Just another plain, casual, alternative outfit. Really not a lot to it, just a t-shirt, jeans, sneakers. Um, I can't decide, this color's a little too close to the denim color, so it's between this t-shirt, this jacket. The jacket balances it out, because the jacket's black and then there's contrast. Or we could do this, I don't know. I think this looks a little stupid. Maybe I just won't bring this. Let's see how much space is in our suitcase. 
not an outfit, but these are my pajamas that I'm bringing with and I just really wanted to share with you guys because I'm obsessed with these. They're from Amazon, I'll have them linked below. I think they were only $30 and I swear I wear these almost every night. Like they just make me feel so bougie. They're satin, they're just perfect for Vegas and I'm so excited to bring them. So, pajama check, check. I mean, honestly, they could be an outfit, but the garbage trucks are about to start getting really loud. So I just wanted to show you my airport fit. This is it. This is always my go-to airport fit. It's super basic, just a black cotton sweatsuit, oversized bag, sneaks, messy bun. Like this is how I'm going to be showing up at the airport. Probably both days because I, I reuse my airport outfit whenever I leave a place too. So this is it. Yee. Last thing I want to mention, I am only bringing a carry-on. Um, it's a short trip. It's like three days, three nights or something like that. So I should be able to fit everything in a carry-on. <laughs> I haven't brought only a carry-on in a long time on a trip. So this is going to be a little bit of a challenge for me, but... I'm confident we can make it happen. Let's pack, yeah. Welcome to my bathroom. <laughs> okay, so we need makeup, obviously, and um, face wash stuff. Oh, this is my body makeup. So <laughs> if I ever wear body makeup, I just use one of these like artiste brushes, but they're not artiste. That This is a real techniques one. And then I use this CoverGirl Clean foundation and mix it with lotion. It's like airbrushing your body, which is great, but it does get everywhere. So choose your battles, I guess. The thing I'm more concerned about is face wash stuff because this is the cleanser I use, just classic Noxzema, and they don't make travel sizes of this. So I could have gotten one of those little travel size, like empty containers and just scooped some into that, but I didn't. This isn't going to work either. I thought I would bring this. It's um, Dr. Sturm cleanser, but it's 16 ounces, which I wasn't expecting. And you can only bring, I think, 3.4 in a carry-on. What's this one? I have one of these enzyme cleansers too. Uh, that is also 16 ounces. I don't know what I'm gonna do. <laughs> uh, I may just be getting cleanser once I get to Vegas. Okay, it's been decided. I'm just gonna buy a cleanser when I get to Vegas because I don't have enough time to go get one at a store today. So we'll just get one when we're there. <laughs> um, that's poor planning on my part. However, I am going to be bringing these facial products. I got a bunch of La Mer, oh, I got a bunch of La Mer samples <laughs> from Sephora and they're nice, um, Wow, that's not gonna focus. They're nice like moisturizing products. Oh my God, oh my God. I think I need to put the camera down for a second and just pack my toiletries and put them in my suitcase and be done with it. So we're gonna skip ahead to that. It fits, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed seeing what outfits I'm gonna be taking to Vegas. I'm excited for this trip. Um, I was in Vegas a little over a year ago, but it was sort of a different vibe. It wasn't super party or fun oriented or anything. So it's gonna be good. We're gonna go to several really nice restaurants and just 
drink and gamble and have a great time while we're there. <laughs> so that's all you can hope for while in Vegas, right? I'm excited. Thanks again for being here. Thanks for checking out my video and I will see you in the next one very soon. Bye.